Hello, good morning. Are you familiar with cooking meat or fish using vinegar? Yes, it's a common practice in um, some restaurants. But think about the idea that your blood may contain a lot of acids. And the truth behind it is these acids in your blood will help degrade your flesh. It cooks your flesh, literally. And the question is, where do we get these acids? Well, one is, you eat it from your food. Too much acids in the food is also bad. It may trigger your organs, your cells, your flesh to be burnt. How about eating too much meat? Yes. Too much animal products contain lots of amino acids and they can cook your flesh, your cells, your organs. How about exercise? Yes, too much buildup of acid during exercise. You keep on running, after a few minutes, you start to breathe deeply. No? You need to catch your breath. That's a sign you're already acidic. Your blood is turned acidic. So why do we need to talk about this acidity of the blood? Well, in, in fact, our body is damaged with too much acids. And the sad truth is too much acids in the blood may trigger your blood to clot. It may also trigger those fats and oils in your blood to aggregate clump together. These, in, these two things may trigger strokes and heart attacks. So why am I talking about this? Well, there is a simple way or remedy you can do. One is, definitely it's dilution with water. Keep on drinking water. Another thing is, you may take sodium ascorbate. As an example, I'm going to show you here with me is a small container with iodine solution. This iodine solution is simply iodine in water, which represents the acidity. A simple analogy. This is not your blood, but it's a close representation of the acidity of your blood. Iodine is somewhat acidic. In water, it's acidic. That's why you use it to clean wounds. Okay? And uh, what we will do is uh, we will put sodium ascorbate in the solution and see what happens. Here is a, an example of an ordinary sodium ascorbate solution, which we are going to... There, I, I broke it. And I'm going to pour just a little bit and see what's going to happen. So, can you see what happened? I'm just going to stir this a little. There. Well, the lesson there is to help prevent the acidity of your blood to cause damage, causing a lot of illnesses. We might as well take sodium ascorbate to counteract the damage, the damaging effects of acids to our body. And at the same time, if we keep on drinking sodium ascorbate, you can help prevent diabetes, strokes, heart attacks, Alzheimer's, even Alzheimer's is a result of acidity in the blood passing through the brain. Okay? Well, I hope you learned. Sodium ascorbate is, a, is very beneficial to our health. You can prevent a lot of diseases. Okay? Nice to know. God is good. God is great. Have a nice day. God bless.